Hello everyone, welcome to Quantum Guruji. So today in this video, I'm going to discuss about uh, how to freeze the coordinates in Gaussian. Okay, so actually I found uh, two three methods to you know freeze the coordinates in Gaussian uh, in the Gaussian calculation, and I will discuss all all those methods how to you know freeze the uh, your uh, uh, specific uh, atoms in the or the coordinates of that specific atoms and do the uh, other calculation okay so i'll first discuss one method suppose this is my molecule any molecule you can choose uh, okay so this is my molecule i have taken here and go to right click go to the Okay. yeah in the tool section you can go and here you can click on the atom groups fine once you have clicked on the atom groups you see here these are your you know or entire uh, molecule and here you see the fragment one in the red color these are the, in the red you see the you know kind of you know some uh, red is uh, outline is here right that uh, correspond to you your elements which is not freezed so uh, there are uh, 63 uh, atoms here in your molecule if you see down here there are 63 atoms here down if you see so 1 to 63 nothing is you know freezed right now now suppose I want to freeze two element suppose I want to freeze this and I want to freeze this okay so before freezing this what you need to select you need to select the atom for that you need to go to this uh, make it full size and click on this atom select okay select atom by clicking click here minimize this now you select the atom I have selected these two atoms okay uh, now I want to freeze the coordinates for these two atoms okay and click on the plus okay so this was atom number 2 and atom number 21 how do I know go to the view and level if you see so this is the atom number 2 and atom number 21 that uh, two I have selected and here it is in the green color if you see here and see here also it is green in the color outer right so that two atoms I have freezed you can select from here uh, that Gaussian fragment I want to uh, freeze it okay so yeah so i want to select on the first you have to select on the freeze initially the red one was not freeze that was uh, 21 to 63 and now you want to freeze that is yes in the green color for that you have to select that atom now i have selected atom number 21 and 2 freeze yes plus so that two atom is now freezed and the other atoms atom from 1 3 to 20 22 to 63 they are not freezed now click on ok ok and from here itself you can go to the calculate and calculation or trick right now I was interested for the TS calculation here ok so whatever calculation you want to do using call this freezing you can go ok if you want to just do a minimum cal um, energy calculation you can choose and go ahead from here itself and another way is so this is one way to make the input right just using this uh, in this uh, tool go to the atom groups and using this atom group editor you can uh, do this freezing your coordinates this is one way another way is if you see the input so this is the input where I have used that uh, group atom another way is to freeze your okay so another way to freeze is put minus charge minus one charge okay minus one not charge this is to freeze your coordinate suppose this is my molecule I will show you here go to the view and go to the level and here suppose 
I am to I want to freeze here atom number two and atom number uh, twenty two. I want to freeze the coordinates for that. So here you see two correspond to palladium and twenty two one correspond to this uh, phosphorus. So if you go to the input of that file, so what I have done at this palladium atom number two, I have put minus one, and atom number twenty nine that is corresponding to phosphorus, I have put minus one. So these minus one correspond to the freezing of your coordinates for that specific atom and other you don't want to freeze put zero 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 okay so this is in between your atom and the coordinates you have to put like this so this means you have freeze these uh, coordinates for these atoms okay so this is another way to freeze your atom so i have given you two way to freeze your atoms right now i will show you the third way Third way to freeze your atoms is using the keywords. First, I have shown you using Gauss view. Second, using that minus one thing. And now I will show you freezing the coordinates using, uh, you know, the keywords. Okay. So the, the molecule is same. The same molecule. Go to the view go to the levels and here again i want to freeze the same atom atom number two atom number 21 two atom i want to freeze so i will prepare the input will be same in the keyword section what you need to put is opt equals more redundant read freeze then your frequency and the level of theory and the functional uh, is the functional and the basis set and once you put this now go down after your coordinates give one space or press enter then you put no atoms that is the number of atoms atom number 1 to 63 so there are atom 63 atoms and out of all 63 atoms and uh, no atoms atom 2 and atom 21 that you want to freeze so these two atoms you want to freeze out of all these atoms so using these keywords also you can do the you can freeze the uh, the specific coordinates for that uh, atom and do the calculation whatever you want and there is one more uh, way to freeze the atoms and I will show you that also okay here in the keyword section it will be similar opt equals to more redundant freak functional and the basis set no symmetry and down I will use this so I have shown you here the and uh, what I, uh, atom you want to freeze is atom number 2 and atom number 21 these two atom you want to freeze okay so after coordinates press enter or any there will be one space then you put X one space atom number 2 F F means freezing so now uh, uh, in the second line I am just putting atom number 21 F space F so I am freezing the atom number 2 atom number 21 using this also you can freeze the coordinates for your atom and all four methods will result in the same uh, results will be same for all these okay so these are four ways to freeze the coordinates in your Gaussian calculation and you want to perform the uh, Gaussian calculation using this uh, freezing techniques so I know these four ways to you know freeze the atoms in the Gaussian. If you know more ways, please discuss and share with us also in the comment section. You can put what are the other ways to you know freeze the atoms. So I know these four ways. Thank you for watching the video. If you have any doubt pertaining to this video, put it in the comment section. Don't forget to like and subscribe.